I'd like to start off first by reassuring all the parents out there and their kids that no animals will be harmed in the upcoming interview or performance. This band is the greatest band in the history of the universe ever. We're joined by Fuzzy Bunny Slaughterhouse today. We're talking to Dr. Philo. Gentlemen, thank you very much for being here. Uh, great to be here. And, and this is true. Your self-titled album, you pompously say that you are the greatest band in the history of the universe ever. I mean, really, is this true? Well, I'm not going to sit here and lie to you guys. Yes, it is. It's true. That's right. Well, mm -hmm. listen, um, we look forward to interviewing our bands every single day, but I have to say I was extra excited for this morning's interview for sure. I can't wait to hear the story behind you guys and how you got together. Well, <laughs> I'm glad you asked that. That's actually a really disturbing story. Uh, see, I'm, an actu I'm a brilliant scientist, as you can I tell. Look uh, at my lab course. coat. Yeah, yeah. Um, and so I decided, how was I going to use my gifts to really help the people of the world? Uh, was I going to cure world hunger or poverty? Pff, that's, that's small change. So right. I decided that I would start recklessly mixing the DNA of humans and unwilling animal subjects. Such as rabbits. That's right, rabbits. And uh, to make a long story short, my funding was non-existent. Uh, you know, my license was revoked or I never actually had one, however you want to look at it. And I was left only with two drunken human subjects and a bunny rabbit I found out back behind a tree. So what you're saying is you decided that the way to help the population was to create genetic freaks. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad to see you're on the same page here, Derek. That's exactly what I'm saying. Um, once this pile of freaks, mutants if you will, was formed, we knew that we had to keep away from the public eye and not freak people out. So we decided to form a band and play gigs around town. So how would you describe, uh, Dr. Philo, the uh, mutant sound, if you will? Well, we're easily the premier rabbit-themed band in the Ottawa Gatineau area. I'd say our songs are heartfelt, uh, moving, and uh, sometimes obscene. Mm -hmm. Our lyrics mm -hmm. focus on things such as socio-political breakdowns in Canadian municipalities, um, right. early 90s children's television, and uh, filthy things I can't really get into here. Now, some people, because of this, might think we're a bunch of jokesters. I mean... <laughs> 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 but really, we take this pretty seriously. Yeah, I can see that. Well, this is getting uncomfortable, I think, for, for TL. Well, that's probably uh, just our man on base, uh, Mr. Right. Johnny Suave. He, uh, his masculinity can be a little over-empowering. I, I, ha I have to excuse myself, actually. Oh, yeah. Masculinity, yeah. yeah. I, I can't wait to see them play, so I have to... I really think we should get them to. I, I think we should thing. get on with the performance and uh, probably call security. Where are you playing next, Dr. File? We're here to pump our show. It's on Easter Sunday at the Rainbow, uh, 9.30. That's this Sunday. Uh, you want to go to our MySpace page, myspace.com, Fuzzy Bunny Slaughterhouse, print out one of these flyers, gets you in the door half price. You half that price. Girls are going to be starting to camp out now. Absolutely, I mean, caused a bit of a I saw them down on uh, Murray Street as we came over here. Yeah. But again, Fuzzy Bunny Slaughterhouse this Sunday, Easter Sunday at 9:30 p.m. Guys, let's rock and roll! All right, yeah. here they are, the Fuzzy Bunny Slaughterhouse here on daytime, ladies and gentlemen. Now this is the tale of an unholy place To love in the great books of lore Where demons and witches dance nude in the streets Unsafe for any man, child or boy Stinking beasts roam the streets As the young children scream shrill cries Break the still of the night There's killers and killers and lepers unclean Hands on me so late your hands sigh Oh, the memories of this place still haunt me Nightmares till the day that I die Indescribable evil forever etched into my eye Regina, Regina Harder than the cold prairie winds Regina, Regina I'm harder than the cold prairie 
carry wind The devil crawled out of the sulfur one eve And cackled as he scratched his back the people came forward and asked him to leave He jumped down the spleens for a snack But the spleens disagreed with his sensitive belly His backside sounded like a French horn So he shrank in the middle of the Roman prairies And that's how China was far Well, I swear my life, that's the truth, boy don't you fudge and ignore what I say This town is so evil you can smell it 16 miles away Regina, Regina Regina, Regina, it blows harder than the cold prairie wind. Regina, Regina, it blows harder than the cold prairie wind. Regina, Regina, it blows harder than the cold prairie wind. No, no. And the finishing pose. I love the poses. I love it. One of These the most anticipated so guests much. of all time on the show right there. <laughs> They'll be back later, so don't you worry. That's don't you right. worry. Lots of fun, these guys. Uh, well, we're going to have lots of fun in the kitchen now, we too, sure are. because.